Yo, hello everyone, and welcome back again to a brand new video. Have you made an error or no longer need an invoice? In this video, you will learn how to safely delete invoices in Zuho in just a few clicks with this easy guide. So, let's get started. Before we start with this video, make sure to watch it from now till the end so you can have the full experience. So in this video guys, we will learn how to delete invoices in Zuho. So first of all, of course, go ahead, open Zuho.com and sign in to your account. Here in Zuho, you need to go to, first of all, access Zuho Home. And from there, you're gonna open the finance one or the invoice one, depending on where did you open it exactly. So invoice will be in the section of finance. So click on invoice and this will open Zuho or invoice.zuho. So here you will find every single invoices that you have created. Now we're not going to jump already to the deleting, but as I said in the beginning, in the end of the video, if you have made a mistake. Now, if you made a mistake, you don't really have to delete the whole invoice, but you can literally just edit it. So if you want here to this mark, you can click on it and click on edit. So yeah, there is a chance that you can fix the invoice. There is no need in deleting it uh, in, in case like it was just a mistake of maybe you have written the amount wrong, quantity wrong or something has been wrong here. You could fix it simply by going in the edit section and edit the invoice itself. You will have here the name, etc maybe the items that you have put are not correct so you can go ahead and delete them right through here so everything is basically editable and can be fixed within the zuho invoice now let's say that yeah you don't really want to fix anything you don't want to edit anything you want to delete then you will have to go back to the first page as you can see i can select it like that and what i'm going to do is click on more and here click on delete so click on these three points delete okay and as you can see here the invoice has been deleted so this is the only way possible and the straightforward way to delete any kind of invoice in zuho so it's very easy nothing complicated about it um you just literally just go into it click on the invoice that you want to delete and delete it Let's just do a quick recap. Let me just create a new invoice. There we go. Let's say um, this is my client and here I'm selling wood planks. And basically, instead of putting quantity as five, I have given the person like five, 55K, 555. Maybe the keyboard glitch at some point so here the amount is gonna be huge like very much like no one can miss it but yeah you might be having a rough day going through a lot and basically you had a lot of products and invoices to be written down and yeah you didn't check this mistake well then of course save as draft and here you simply gonna go to the plus button and as you can see, click on the delete. Just through here, click on delete. You can enter this action, proceed with it, and it should be removed. It's very easy, simple, nothing much complicated about it. So the oversteps are basically uh, the same, nothing weird, uh, but um, like it's very simple i'm just covered at the beginning the fact that you could fix it in case you wanted to fix it but otherwise if your goal your final goal is to simply delete the invoice then yeah just go straight forward delete it and make sure that within the next invoice that you create make sure to fix the number of the invoice so the number can be going like with the same order uh, there will not be something missing between them for example now i'm on the invoice number three the next invoice i'm gonna create is number four what if i deleted number three that means there is no number three you will go around uh what's happened what happened what really happened let's just 
like skip all these problems and basically make sure to change the upcoming invoices numbers so you could be resolving this problem uh, from its original uh, like cause and yeah that is pretty much it for today's video guys i hope you enjoyed it if you did please make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you do have any more questions or problems do not be shy of writing them in the comment section we try our best to cover all of your topics problems and issues that you have faced and try to give you the best videos and solutions for those so yeah guys that was it for today's video thank you guys a lot and see you guys in the next tutorial